We explain the 1923 World Series, the third Subway Series in a row. The third meeting of the Yankees and the Giants would move beyond the polo grounds for the first time, as the Yankees had completed Yankee Stadium just in time for the 1923 season. Opening day featured a three-run homer by Babe Ruth against the Red Sox, although with the acquisition of George Pipgrass and Curb Pennock, the Yankee lineup featured four former Red Sox and six of their eight pitchers, as Harry Frizee continued to look for theater funding, then eventually just selling the Red Sox. After a terrible 22 season and a dressing down by future New York Mayor Jimmy Walker for his drunken behavior, Babe Ruth got in shape and tried to be a better role model. He hit 41 home runs, led the AL in seven categories, batted a .393, and was fueled by a new young player on the Yankees named Lou Gehrig. McGraw would direct every one of the pitches thrown at Ruth. Despite the bravado of the Yankees, who finished 16 games ahead in their division, the Giants would take Game 1 from an in-the-park homer by Casey Stengel, who lost his shoe in the process of running the bases. Then Game 2 came around, and Ruth hit two homers, one that went out of the polo grounds to lead the Yankees to a win. However, in Game 3, Stengel hit another game-winning homer and thumbed his nose at the Yankees in the dugout coming home. The Yankees answered back in Game 4 and 5 with 16 runs and 27 hits, which included multiple run homers by Joe Dugan and Ruth. The Giants hit three triples and two doubles during the series, and Stengel led the team in home runs, runs batted in, and getting to base on balls. But the Giants just couldn't match the late-game bursts of the Yankees, who would win 4-2 for their first championship. McGraw would trade Stengel away after the season ended. Gehrig was not allowed to play in this series under rules that mid-season players could not play. Landis left the decision up to McGraw, who was quick to nix Gehrig's bat from the lineup. Hall of Famers include Huggins and Ruth, Waite Hoyt, Pennock, McGraw, Dave Bancroft, Frankie Frisch, Travis Jackson, George Kelly, Stengel, and Ross Young. <laughs>